I work around zero. Whitman, EPA director, on the 18th made a statement that the air was safe to breathe. On September 11, 2001, along with hundreds of my fellow troops, I went to ground zero. We went because our city, our country, our neighbors were under attack. And we knew what to do, or at least we thought we did. We were all here seven years ago, and the government turned their back on us. Please help us now. The fact that any government official can play God with human life, they should be in jail. They should go to jail. If this could be done to a national hero, a guy who fought in Iraq, it could be done to everybody. When we first started out in New York City, then we were just brainstorming. What can we do to have the most amount of change? It's terrific. Yeah, is it? I get Oh Yeah, you're very mature. My father died in these towers. Uh, there's nothing private. Just so, to see what you Take that stupid. camera. You want to show me what you feel? Because of what? You can't record this. You got to shut that off. You can't be recording this. Shut that off. It's, it's a public sidewalk, though. They think he's got a bomb in his bag. You're going to, you know, threaten us? Well, you know what? I'm going to confront every political candidate there is because they're not going to silence me and they're not going to stop me. The latest happened in Minneapolis where President Clinton was speaking at a fundraiser for his wife. An inside job? How dare you? They don't investigate themselves in this country. Those people, they wouldn't be a white one. It would be like the Kennedy thing, it would be like everything. Uh, the jet fuel is four fifths kerosene, which is not a hot burning fuel. And they want us to believe that it melted these steel structure girders. And every time popular mechanics calls the people of this movement, Nuts, these propagandists strike another nail into the coffin of another rescue worker. The truth will come out. 